Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 2 Uberhood. We are here with the Cap family. This is um, Albany Cap. And yes, his name is said Albany. But <laughs> believe me, I am from New York and the capital of New York is Albany. A-L-B-A-N-Y, Albany. Not Albany to all those simmers out there who <laughs> say it that way. Um, it really irritates me because it's the capital of the state that I'm from and it is said Albany. So you're welcome. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> just on a silly note to start. <laughs> um, so we are here with Albany and his wife, uh, Gonreal, Gonreal, and their children are um, Miranda oh, and Hal, Desdemona and Ariel. Ariel is the toddler over here that's just chilling like a villain. Um, she got up really early in the morning and was just doing some random things. So, yeah. Um, Albany wants to have another baby and Desdemona is getting ready for work because she's already at that stage. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and have Albany take care of Ariel's dirty diaper. So let's go ahead and have him change her diaper. Change her diaper. Change her diaper. And then she also needs a little bit of food. So we are going to get her a bottle as well. So come on over here and um, get a bottle for Ariel as well. Now the kids are all up because it is a Tuesday. So they do have school today. So yeah, they're all getting ready for school, kinda. I guess this is getting ready for school. Who knows? Um, he must have an A plus support card, so we could try and aim for that. And so does she as well. She also wants to be friends with Sally and Sharla. I also want to take the paint off of her face um, when she becomes a teenager, of course. I'll let her have it as a child because, I mean, what child doesn't want to dress up like a fairy? Okay, so that's just my thought process. Okay, there is no breakfast, so let's serve up some breakfast. Let's make up some butter toast for the family. That'll be really good. And then the baby um, need, wants to learn to walk and to talk, so we will do that today. But for right now, I'm going to have her come play with some of these toys just to get her out of the way of the kitchen. Now, the kids are already on the school bus, so they're not going to be eating lunch. Oh my gosh, look at the default replacement for these plants. Look how great that looks. Like, it looks so voluptuous compared to what it normally looks like which is not voluptuous obviously okay so he he made toast um obviously he is the only one eating it but that's okay because you know we need it for later in life um with this i have added some new lifetime wishes so all teens and down will be able to get the option of getting the new lifetime wishes which is really exciting and fun um, we're just gonna like click on it um, and then when they do it it'll bring up a list and then I'll just randomize a number and that'll be the lifetime wish that they get so that'll be really fun to get some new lifetime wishes that we can work towards which will be really really fun some of them seem like really interesting so I'm excited it's like it's like the person who created the lifetime wish chooser they added in 50 life new lifetime wishes so I'm really excited about that all right we're gonna answer the phone and we're gonna also put away the food and um, I think that was a maid that just showed up here no that's a gardener I think yeah. Why are you kicking over my trash can, you nerd? Pick this up and clean it up. If she was one of my sims, she would actually just got a fine. So, that's the thing. Yeah, the gardener is here. Leo, your plants are in wonderful condition. They don't need any attention from me today. All right, good. We don't have very much money, so we don't really want to be spending on a gardener. So, yeah. Okay, can you... What, oh, he's talking on the phone. Okay. Well, I think he should dispose of this then. And we do want to teach the baby a little bit, but she's getting very tired. So I think what we should do is have her take a quick nap before we... um. 
before we try to teach her anything. So we'll put Ariel in the crib. Whenever he decides to get off here. Oh, we do have a maid. Okay, never mind. Don't worry about those. The maid will take care of him. I think we need to put the default roads on because I don't think we have it. No, we don't. Okay. So we need to put the default roads on. I know this can be really annoying, but it just makes the world look so much better. Um, and I personally really like it. At first, I wasn't sure I would like having default roads because of how much work they are. But once you get them all covered, it's no big deal because it's no more work after that. So you only have to do this one time and then you're like done. So it's totally worth it. And there's zero simoleons. So like how can you beat it, you know? And I just, doesn't that look so much better? I know it's not properly placed here, but doesn't that look so much better with like the default road? Ooh, so much better. Also have the default replacements of the plants. So they have like more detail as well. And grass, I think, as well. So that's also a thing. Mm. Holy cannoli. Yeah, Kicking it. Okay, I did give him some body hair because I downloaded that mod as well. I think we need to, um... Is this body hair the right color? It's like brown. That don't look right. <laughs> Maybe it's supposed to be, um... Blonde, but it's coming out black-ish colored. I don't know. Look at the sky. Holy cannoli. Is it black or is... No, it's blonde. It's just because it looks like the shadow of it. Okay. So it's proper. Good. We'll get the mail. We need to pay the bills. So... Yes. Throw them in the road. Let's pay our bills. They're only 168 simoleons. So that's really good. And you're supposed to put Ariel in the crib. What happened here? Uh, you're in the way. This person's trying to get through. <laughs> Nobody in real life would have been that chill. They would have been like honking at him and stuff. <laughs> Why do we need two bookshelves next to each other? It'd be different if that was like a study and I was trying to go for like a a look. <laughs> Doesn't look like I'm trying to go for anything. What is also going on with these counters? <laughs> what is going on? All right, let's um wow. That's quite the sink. Can we get rid of this and get a different sink? Can we like Can we get a different sink? There's got to be a cheaper a cheaper option. Okay, let's get that. Can we get that in white? Yes. Uh, we had that one, didn't we? Yeah, why would we have that sink? It's so expensive. Holy Moses. Yeah. Silly headed. Oh, that's not even it's not even properly placed. It don't look like. Wait, is it? I think it's a sink doing that. Okay. Alright, we're really broke now, but it's okay. Alright, it's looking like he's a little bit hungry still. It looks like the buttered mm. toast didn't quite fill him up, so let's get him some lunch. We'll have just a lunch meat sandwich, nothing too big. Um, and then let's have him use this, and he can take a shower as well. And then he needs some fun. Um, I also want him to head down into Pleasant View, go to the social services building, and... Um, I want him to um, apply for some funding because this family is very big, um, but he doesn't have any wishes to get a job. So if that's how it's going to be, that's fine. But he needs to be bringing in some kind of money so he can go be on like welfare pretty much. So we'll have him do that once someone is here to watch after Ariel. I don't want to pay for a babysitter because we really don't need to fork out any more cash for anything um, until we start getting some money coming in a little bit more. So we're going to go ahead and do that and since the maid just left when you're done with your shower why don't you go ahead and clean up the plate because we don't really want to leave that that's 
kind of like pointless if you literally have the maid come and then just make a mess right after they leave. All right, Miranda's grades are improving um, and she does not have an after school job. So once Miranda gets home, or now that she is home actually, we can oh, have her watch after Ariel oh, while God. he walks down to a lot. So we will have him walk to a community lot um, so that we can get him the welfare that he needs to be able to afford his family. Also think we could delete one of those bookshelves, but I'm not too worried about it at the moment. Um, I just want to get them all situated. So he is 27 days. Gamriel has 32. Miranda has 13. Hal has 5. Desdemona has 8. And Ariel has 6. So that's exciting. Alright, let's walk to a community lot. Um, we're not going to take anyone with us. We are going to go down to the social services in Pleasant View. So once he gets down to the social services, I will cut back in. But until then, I will be back in just a second. Okay, so here we are at social services. And we are going to go ahead and have him walk right on over here. I feel like I need to put in the updated version of this because I've deleted some CC and stuff, but um, mm. does it look bad? Oh, this is the updated version. Never mind. This is it. Alrighty. Perfect. Okay. So we came here, we applied and we were accepted awesome so we could just stick around for a little bit maybe meet some people he could get, greet cleo and those two are not our sims okay can you stop it um yeah so really the only person here that's our sim is cleo like look at how lush this looks holy moly i might have to delete these now they weren't this big before, but they are really, they are now. Oh, Dina's also our sim. I think that's it, though. Uh, okay. All right, so we've met everyone here that's our sims. Now we can go ahead and have him walk back home. There we go. More people are showing up now, but like, like Patricia and Vidkind. Oh, Vidkind, you pregnant old man. <laughs> it's funny. Oh my gosh, who's flirting? I swear to goodness, I just heard someone flirting. These look really nice, though. He's <laughs> All right, so once he gets back home, I will cut back in. So I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so um, Albany is coming back home. Um, we're here with Miranda and Ariel. She actually wants to have her first kiss. Oh, my goodness. Um, she has a crush on uh, Mercutio. So I might have her call him up and see if he'll come on over and see if we can get that first kiss for her. So let's call a Sam. And this is the perfect time to do it because her dad's not home and neither is her mom. So it's like perfect time to call him up and see if Mercutio will come over and um, give her a little oh, smoochy smooch on the lippy toodles. Okay, so Ariel, she, oh my goodness, she just wants to learn everything at this moment. Um, so yeah, <clears throat> let's um, have her go out here and we're just going to wait for him. Oh my gosh, she is really excited. We need to change this to this now. Like this needs to be changed to this br this tile. Just go here for a second. It's okay. Oh goodness. Our brothers and sister is getting off the bus. And we're about to be smacking it with our man. Uh, well, he's not our man, I guess. So that's right. Let's go ahead and greet him. Forget about the baby for just a second. She's okay. He's like, my grades aren't great. <laughs> 
Okay, so we're not gonna waste any time. We're just gonna try to get the first kiss. Um, she does have, like I said, they do have a crush on each other. They're not friends though. Okay, let's maybe talk to him a little bit. We'll admire him, entertain him with a joke. We can admire him. We can hug him, maybe romantically. Try flirting a little bit, we'll hit on him. And then maybe we can go for the first kiss. Okay, Desdemona, we get it. She's Louise. <laughs> Wait, she has like 10 minutes before her dad gets home. Uh oh. Well, this didn't happen before I, I, um, her dad got home, I guess, so. Hmm. Interesting. Whoa, it just popped in that they're friends and best friends now. Holy moly. Uh-oh. I don't know if he's gonna like her. Oh my goodness. I don't know if he's gonna like her, like, kissing on, um, Mercutio. So... Yeah. About that. But anyways, <laughs> this kiss is grand. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. So yeah. Uh, I really want to get them a picture of these two. So. Oh my goodness. So much is popping up. Like way too much is popping up. Okay. Ganryo got home as well during that kiss. So that's interesting. And she brought home 618. This is just people saying that we haven't contacted them in a while. Probably because some of them are... Um, Monty's, I think. Let me go ahead and open up my program real quick. Okay, so we should be good to go ahead and have them be a little bit more romantic. And let's just go ahead and have them do a romantic kiss. I know that she doesn't want to, but I want to do it for this screenshot. Um, I'm going to point it in this direction so, you know, mom isn't in the background. Because I just think that's a little bit much. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and just grab this photo for the cover photo, obviously. Um, yeah. yeah and yeah. now we can just move on. Um, she does want to be a little bit romantic with her husband. So, I think maybe we'll go ahead and let her do that. Also, Ariel is still in the crib and having a heart attack. So let's go ahead and potty train Ariel real quick because she does have to go potty. Where did he go? He just literally came in and went and sat down and watched TV. Like, bro, if you want to have all these kids, you need to take care of them. You can't just freaking leave them in their crib 24-7. Also, I did roll for their um their traits. <gasps> Do you guys know what this means? They're about to woohoo and she get... I'm going to have to roll a number to see if she gets pregnant. Okay, we can't do this right now because I think he's going to have to come in here to do it. Uh, let's do it in the hallway. I'm real... Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. Gracious. Great balls of fire. Um, so, for teenagers, I roll a number one through a hundred. And if they are You're uh -huh. below um, 30, they get pregnant. Because teens technically are more fertile than adults or young adults. 521 a day. Awesome. That's after he upgraded it and added the children to the application. Which is pretty good because honestly we do need the extra monies. So that'll be great. Okay, she wants to kiss Albany, so I am going to let her kiss him. They can make out when she's done potty training Ariel, because Ariel really had to go pee. Um, and she does want to get potty trained. She also wants to learn to walk and to talk and cutscene again. Oh, boy. All right, well, I guess we're rolling a number. Let me roll. Let me see if we get a good number. Um, Lana. um, random number generator, one through 30. I know it's not on the screen. I do apologize. I'm going to figure out how to do that eventually one day. Not 130. Holy Moses. <laughs> one through thir 100, I mean. One through 100. 
She got four. She got four. Oh no. She's gonna have a baby with Mercutio. I have to do it with cheats. Um Yeah. And then I think because she won't have it unless she becomes an independent teen. So I have to set Miranda to independent teen. Oh, guys. Uh, it just means that her wishes and things will be a little bit more like an adult's. Um, but I think she will progress through her pregnancy. I'm really scared for her. This is going to be a really hard time. And because it's a Monty, her parents might kick her out. Oh, boy. Things just got really, really hard. All right. She wants to gain a cooking point. She doesn't need cooking for work, though. Um, she can flirt with him and talk to him. Oh my goodness, Miranda, what have you done? No, stay here. Okay, I think, um, I think she should go to the bathroom and come and get some leftovers. She still has 12 days before she becomes a, um, like a young adult. All right, we're going to go ahead and have her ask for homework help. Um, how do I, I forget how to do this. Go ahead and eat that. Um, ask for homework help, Albany. And then he wants to also ask for homework help. So he's actually going to ask his mom for homework help. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Ask for homework help from Gonreal. Or Gonoreal. Gonoreal. I don't know how to say her name. Okay, I know how to say Albanese, but I don't know how to say hers. So come at me, okay? <laughs> okay, listen. He wants help, please. Miranda's good. Um, for some reason, it's like she doesn't have homework. Does she not have homework? Okay, I'm going to move this underneath this table because they don't really need to access it. Um, it's just for that. And also, we can delete this now because no one needs body hair at the moment. Um, she should also say goodbye to him because when her parents find out that she's pregnant with his baby, they are going to flip. Um, I think she should, she doesn't know herself yet, but once she finds out and they find out, I think things are going to get really scary, honestly. Um, did she not ask for homework help? Seriously, what is going on? Um, okay, I want, before you finish it, I wanted you to ask for homework help. So let's see if she can do it. Um, ask for homework help from your dad, and you are supposed to ask for homework help from your mom. And that is my timer. Okay, what is wrong with the baby? She needs a bath. Do we not have a bath in this house? Seriously. Oh my goodness, we don't. What's wrong with me? Why would I do that? Okay, they're doing it. How? I really want you to ask your mom for homework help, please. Okay. Maybe you can just like... Wait, can you bathe her in the sink? No, you can't. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to delete this shower. And we're going to get a tub shower combo. I know I'm over my time. Please forgive me. Um, we can't even afford a, shub, a tub shower combo. Okay, we're just going to have to get a tub. We're just going to have to get a tub. 
Go ahead and bathe Ariel, please. Yes, please bathe her. You're helping her, so you're doing something beneficial. Are these guys coming? Like, seriously, go here. Go here. I feel like these sims are not listening to me right now. They're just like, mind of their own. Okay, now ask your mom for help, please. Okay, good. Now you go ahead and get leftovers. We're going to have you clean up this nasty bottle. And then you are going to also get leftovers. Spaghetti. There's three plates of spaghetti. So the three kids. Okay, so he's actually going to need to make up dinner so serve dinner why don't you make um some sandwiches they're quick and easy okay what else does the baby need after this she needs to go to the bathroom and she also needs to um go to bed so then you can potty train her real quick when you're done bathing her she was disgusting. Like, seriously disgusting. Um, yeah. And then when she's done eating, um, it's 10 o'clock, but we'll let her play with toys for a little, bio, little while. <sighs> These guys are going to be working on homework for a little while. Okay, he wants to have a baby, so we are going to have them try for baby. I'm just going to play until they're all in bed, by the way. I'm not going to play much longer, so it won't be too much longer of an episode. Um, and some of it is cut out, too, because I did travel today, so it'll be all good. All right, you can eat this. Um, once you potty train her, then you can put her in the crib. And you're going to eat this. And then how... You're going to eat this sub, buddy. And then you're good to go. Once you're ready, you can go to bed. I don't think that'll stop her from playing. I think she'll play until she feels like she's ready to go to bed. So I think we're good there. Okay. Um, I think you can go ahead and put away these leftovers. And then you can put away these leftovers. And then I'm going to let him go to the bathroom real quick. And then I'm going to have him relax. When she's done, she can just come relax on the bed. Because they are going to try for baby because he wants to have a baby. Um, when she's done eating, she can just go to bed herself. And when Hal is done eating, he can use the bathroom and head to bed. So everyone is all set up and ready to go. Um, yeah. I'm going to speed up while they're just eating because they are slow in this game at eating so make sure that we get this all done there we go everyone is taking care of their next actions Miranda is the last one done how is her hunger she's good she's just really tired so we need to get her to bed because she can have a miscarriage um, so we do want to make sure that she does not have that happened to her um at such a young age that would be very devastating all right gonorrhea don't fall asleep yet you are gonna be great um okay i'm gonna tell her to stop playing and go to bed it is 12 30 at night and now it is time for her to absolutely go to bed <clears throat> i am gonna have these guys um lay on down and they will um woohoo and try for baby and then we're gonna go from there all right, so casual, try for baby. That is going to take into consideration um, their age and things so it won't be so, like, cheaty. Um, and, yeah. So tell me what you guys think of this. Do you guys think this is nice? Also, do you guys think they're going to have a baby? I don't have the chimes, so that's a thing. But that would mean that um, Goneril and um, Miranda would be having a baby, like, right at the same time. That would be intense. Yeah, about that. Oh no. I think they finished, didn't they? I think so. Did they finish? I think they did. 
Because it didn't show the little woo-woo symbol anymore. Okay, so they're going to actually go to bed, and I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. So if you guys enjoyed this, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. I cannot believe we are having our first teen pregnancy. Um, I did not expect that today. So anyways, yeah, like I said, if you guys enjoyed it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. In the description below is all of my social media links, so definitely check those out. Please don't forget to follow me over on Twitch if you're interested in live streams, um, where I live stream The Sims 2, 3, and 4 sometimes. It depends on what we're playing or what we're doing in the moment. Um, tonight is a live stream at uh, 9 to 11 p.m. I do live stream Wednesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays, so that would be awesome if you guys could join me there. And also don't forget to check out my Discord where you can share all of your own stories and pictures of your own games where we would love to see them and talk about them and I will talk to you guys in my very next one thanks very much for watching